Always willing to listen. Could you tell me where stage eight is, please? Oh? Stage eight? Ah. Over there. Ah. No, it's not. Jabba the Hutt's palace. Ah. Oh, my. Oh. Oh. We should have our own electrician. The last one used alternating current. Imagine, Arthur was walking backwards, but and if we could have our own dressing room, our two batteries do take up a great deal of space. Three P. O. Please be reasonable. We've got so many stars in this movie. I'm desperate. President Arthur was star, and the most important one. And if I might remind you, without me, nobody would understand a thing he says. Come in. An Ewok. And another thing, on our way to work, Chewbacca always sits in the front seat. Now, I know he has long legs, but R2 gets car sick. So if we could have a limousine of our own. 3 pure, please. Can I help you? I'm an Ewok, and some people thought I should be with Frank Oz. Could you tell me where he is, please? Then, um, pardon me, little Ewok. Might I just finish what I was saying? They're bound to need me on the set any moment now. A larger dressing room. A limousine of our own, and our very own electrician. 3 pure, there are no larger dressing rooms. The electricians are working 18 hours a day looking at these time sheets, and I'm over a budget on transport. Alternative in 
I know you have problems. So perhaps I could see your master. I'm sure George Lucas would understand. He's always treated me just like a human being. And I'm sure if you told him what I have... <laughs> what happened? What did you do? There's a switch here. I saw it in Empire Strikes Back. Three films. Three films I've put up with his complaining and I didn't know about that switch. <laughs> Get on to the Muppet office, would you, and see if Jim Henson or Frank Oz's assistant could come across. Yeah. Now then, Freakio, I think there's a way whereby you can resolve all your problems to our satisfaction. You can spend the night in my office, save on transportation and publicity. You've done me a really big favor, little fellow, and I owe you a big debt of gratitude. Come in! Robert, do you want to see me? Oh yes, Patsy. My little friend here is an Ewok and he thinks he ought to be with you. No, sir. No Ewoks. Not with the Muppets. No, sir. Nobody seems to know where I should be. Try Yoda. He would know. Yoda? Do you know Yoda? Of course I do. He and Frank are very close. You might even say they work hand in glove. Come on, I'll show you where to go. Not him again. Can I help you? Is he after you too? Yes, he's after his biggest phone number and I won't give it to him. I'm sorry about that. Wow, that was close. Come on, let's go. Fine, thanks again. <laughs> well, little you walk journey a long way. Huh? Yes, expecting you was I. <laughs> Ewoks come from the green moon of Endor. Where is that, Yoda? <clears throat> In a galaxy far, far away. But how do I get there? On the table. Your galactic passport and ticket. <laughs> Thank you. 